This game is using 100% of my GPU. Uh, it's mining Bitcoin. Wait, what is this? Fennec Windows 64 shipping.exe. Oh my God, it's an actual fucking token. It's an actual token. It's unironically mining. Game of the year, Rioters 2025. What is this? Rioters 2025 is a FPS online shooter game. So this is the video that the developer for Rioters 2025 uploaded. It's literally just like an OBS screen capture. Game clearly made in Unity. Walk speed set to 0.2. Holy sh**, this looks like ass. There's like weird blur and the depth of field looks awful. Dude, the dev showing how shit his game is in his own trailer. A realistic FPS online and offline AI 16 versus 16 shooter game. Weapon customizations. For now, the game contains six weapons, but we working to add more soon. Character set customizations. There is a different variety of cloth weapon system. You can shoot behind walls. The bullet damage will reduce, depend on the material of the wall. The AI system is very advanced. I guess Forsen played this. Chat, we're playing a little bit of a, hopefully a non-problematic game called Rioters 2025. Oh, it launched in vr that's awesome okay quit steam vr oh okay so i can select a faction police or rioters the rioters are just people with guns oh i'm getting eight frames a second so i have the game running at the title menu and i'm getting eight frames a second video settings borderless window no v-sync on here this is what's going to be killing our pc here yep don't need that up don't need that up post-processing needed on medium texture streaming foliage don't care about none of it so now how are we doing we're getting 30 fps now there's no reason for the game to be consuming a whole lot of my uh ram but it does okay 13 fps all right let's go to my task manager this game is using 100 of my gpu uh it's mining bitcoin hold on one second let me restart the game is it still mining bitcoin after i closed it what a beefy fucking game it must be better than crisis considering how hard it is to run right let's just turn down the resolution to 1080 let's make it windowed how do i apply these settings how do I apply these settings? Holy shit. <laughs> My fucking PC, please. Yeah, maybe it's my wallpaper. Just assuming that it actually is my wallpaper. Let's just close wallpaper engine completely. Quit. All right. Something about desktop window manager using 52.2% of my graphics card. This doesn't sound right. The game is actually not Unity. It's Unreal Engine. And we'll look down here. We'll actually see that Unreal Engine is using a very minimal 3%, 800 megs of RAM, no network, no disk usage, no GPU usage. Closed Leaf game. Oh, you're right. It's probably my Leaf Blower Revolution that's causing it to lag. Maybe I should close OBS. Maybe OBS is causing this to lag. You know what I think we got to do, chat? We just got to stop bitching. We got to actually get a lobby going. Capture a specific window, and we are looking to capture... Wait, what is this? Fennec Windows 64 shipping.exe? What is Fennec? <gasps> oh my god, it's an actual fucking token. It's an actual token. It's an actual token. It's unironically mining. Fennec token. The guy gets people to download his game, and then... Okay, hold on. Let me close the game so I can actually talk. Let me, let me, let me go. The store page for this game. Any game that looks like this straight away should be a fucking red flag, right? Riders 2025, the trailer for the game is seven minutes and 52 seconds of gameplay developed by some guy named DND, &D, which means do not disturb, holy shit. Riders 2025 is a FPS online shooter game. Mixed reviews, half of the 12 reviews are positive. Amazing Battle Royale, probably the best game I found at little. 10 out of 10, the money's been transferred to your PayPal. Please remove this part of the message. A little bit of a force and e ascii can i look at all the reviews can i look at the, the negative reviews oh they're all in different languages please do the optimization first and then release the game it is destined to be cool shit unplayable 10 fps and if you want 50 fps you need to reduce the resolution as low as possible ping under 200 there is no one on the server <laughs> So the guy uploads the game, it takes off a little bit, it gets a little bit of attention, a little bit of popularity, and then he updates the game. It says right here on steamdb.info slash patch notes, whatever this page is, this thing right here, it breaks down the patch notes for a game, yeah? Change files in this update. He removed the base fucking pack for the game. He removed the, the game, the binaries, Win64. He removed the, the regular .exe that it runs. And the only way I was able to tell is because whenever I try to game cap, 
capture it. The name of the window that OBS reads is Fennec Win64 Shipping.exe. What the fuck is Fennec? Like the fox? If you look up Fennec, just because my main suspicion is that it's a crypto miner, Fennec Crypto, what do we get? Fennec Token Official. It's a defy, oh, oh sorry, de meme token. It's a shit coin. It's an unironic shit coin that this guy uses your PC to mine. The shit coin was launched in May of 2021. This game was released a few days ago and they actually charge money for the game. I'm launching the game one more time. I wanna see if I can actually play the game. I wanna see what went into it. And while the game is open, I'm also gonna have my GPU usage. <laughs> Let's see if we can find a game. Dedicated server. He has one dedicated server. Let's fucking go. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, I can run. The movement speed in this game is a little too fast for my liking. Having a hard time keeping up with my surroundings here. I'm a big fan of how at no point I'm holding my head straight up at all. I'm a huge fan of the moving reticle crosshair, like I'm playing a game from 2008. Yeah, these are just like Unreal Engine 4 assets just like plopped down. Holy shit, is that a hand animated reload? Customized character? I'd really like to customize my character actually. So jacket one and jacket three. Okay, jacket two for sure, 100%. Head, let's change that head up. Oh yeah, hell yeah, dude, we love that shit. Are those night vision gogs, my guy? Oh, he's had variety of cloth. There's one pant. There's literally one fucking pant. Oh, the riders get a bunch of pant. For example, khaki cargo. You also get blue cargo, black cargo, and khaki cargo. Let me check my GPU usage down here. Oh, yep, yeah, still sitting at 100%. All right, game's probably just needing some optimization. Head, we get a completely different head size. So you have either no neck or neck. I'm gonna go with no neck. I feel like that's a tactical advantage. Real quick, the temperature in my room, I can feel it getting really hot in here. Let's check. Ooh, interesting. Look at my office. It's fucking 78 in here. Can we hit 80? I think we can hit 80. I'm confident. Scoreboard, can I add bots to the game? Where's the AI at? Can I shoot the truck? Will it blow up? <laughs> That's the fucking sound from Gold Knight 007. <laughs> Let's pretend there's a dude on the end of my cross here. Holy shit! Whoa! One of the biggest reasons there's probably no bots loaded in the game is so it can save hardware resources for mining crypto token. Can I, can I please, what? D defeat? This game fucking sucks. Game over. Okay, leave match. Um, am I supposed to see that? Host game, here we go. Oh, we have multiple maps. Police, all the police, and all the rioters. Bot level seven. Lobby name, piss time. Oh wait, hold on. Die in hell at developer. Oh wait, hold on, sorry. That doesn't make any sense to say that. Burn in hell at dev. Fuck your crypto miner. There we go, that makes sense. All right, so let's go with riders so I can kill cops. Holy shit, I can't hear anything. Whoa, game design. I can't see shit. Are there bots down there? I can't hear anything. Thanks to these robotic arms that aren't actually moving. Oh shit, I see a bot. I I saw him. He's gone now. Ah! Got him! Ah! Oh shit. There's a guy down there. Did I get him? Did I get him? I can't tell. Look at the GPU. We moved down 92% CP or GPU. Fuck. Let me turn on my camera to see if it looks okay alongside the gameplay. Oh, it looks pretty good actually. Nice. Oh shit! Ah! Holy shit. I'm insane. I'm so good. Double kill. Oh, that was two and one. Oh my god. Ah! I got him. Holy shit, self defense 101. Ah! 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 Scoreboard. 
Dude, look at that. 16 and 3? I'm insane. I would even go so far as to say that this game is esports ready. This game is ready for the tournament scene. I can't wait to see what 100 Thieves gets together for this game. I'm excited to see Cloud9 participate in the next event. Oh, Jesus. Real quick, I gotta check a couple of my temps. This isn't so bad. 73C on the GPU, not too bad. And 67 on the CPU, that's not the worst. I will say, having the game open, it's not too good on the webcam. Like, it kind of makes everything a little choppy over here. My GPU just being, I don't know, I feel like it doesn't get much higher than that, right? Windows Desktop Manager, it doesn't sound right. This doesn't sound right. I feel like maybe turning your game into a little bit of a crypto miner is not the biggest and best move you could make as far as like, making sure your game gets out there. But I have closed the game. Let's see if desktop window manager. Okay, so yeah, it has gone down to 0% usage. 